Good day everyone. Here's our math challenge for today. And here's our question. Let x and y be real numbers such that x plus 22 over y plus 290 over xy equals 26 minus y over x. The question is, what is the value of x times y? Now, if you want to try this problem, just pause this video. We have 20 seconds and timer starts now. Time's up. Now let's answer this question together. This question comes from Hong Kong International Mathematical Olympiad hit round on 2022. Now, how are we going to answer this question? Our goal here is to find the value of x times y. So first thing to do is to multiply all terms with xy. If you do that, we get xy times x plus 22 over y plus xy times 290 over xy equals xy times 26 minus y over x. Now, let's simplify. xy times x plus 22 over y will give us x squared plus 22x. Now, xy times 290 over xy, xy cancel out, so this is just 290. On the right-hand side, xy times 26 minus y over x, this will give us 26y minus y squared. Now, let's rearrange some terms and equate this to 0. So, we have x squared plus 22x plus y squared minus 26y plus 290 equals 0. Now, let's group all terms having x and all terms having y. Now, these groupings tells us that we need to add something to make this polynomial a perfect square trinomial. So, to make this a perfect square trinomial, what we're going to do is to get 22 divided by 2 will give us 11. Then, 11 squared will give us 121. So, we need to add 121 to x squared plus 22x. Now, since we add 121 to make it balance, we need to subtract 121. Now, we will do the same thing in this expression, y squared minus 26 times y. Let's add something to make this expression a perfect square trinomial. So to do that, let's get negative 26 divided by 2. We have negative 13. The negative 13 squared will give us 169. So let's add 169 and don't forget to subtract 169 to make it balance. Now, 290 minus 121 minus 169 is just 0. So we have now x squared plus 22x plus 121, we know this is a perfect square trinomial. And if we simplify this, this is just x plus 11 quantity squared. Also, this y squared minus 26y plus 169 is also a perfect square trinomial. And if we simplify this, this is just y minus 13 quantity squared. Now we have a square number plus another square number that is equal to 0. And take note that x and y are both real numbers. So to make this happen, x plus 11 must be 0 and y minus 13 is also 0. Now x plus 11 equals to 0, it tells us that x equals negative 11. And then on the other equation, y minus 13 equals to 0, it tells us that y must be 13. Now we have the value of x and we have the value of y. Take note that our goal here is to solve for the value of x times y. So x times y is just negative 11 times 13. And negative 11 times 13 is just negative 143. Therefore, the value of xy in this equation x plus 22 over y plus 290 over xy equals 26 minus y over x is just negative 143. And as always, we are done.